Because when you try to sow the seeds of doubt in people's minds about the legitimacy of our elections, that undermines our democracy. And Wolf, this is something that Democrats are largely seeing and the campaign is largely seeing as a fatal mistake by Donald Trump just a few weeks out from Election Day. They certainly see it as a political gift to them, but they're also genuinely concerned uh, from some of the rhetoric uh, that they've heard from Donald Trump last night at the debate and, uh, as you, and as you heard today, President Obama outlining that. Brianna, we also heard from the First Lady Michelle Obama in Arizona uh, just a little while ago. She's also a powerful, very powerful critic of Trump. Tell us about that. Yeah, she could be one of the most powerful surrogates for Hillary Clinton because of her reach uh, with the uh, Obama coalition and certainly with women. So she actually was lobbing a criticism at Donald Trump, one that at times has been lobbed at Hillary Clinton, that he is rich and out of touch with the middle class. But she also basically said that he's racist, he's sexist, and he's prejudiced against all kinds of different people. Here's what she said. Maybe it's easy for him to mock people with disabilities because he's unable to see their strength and their contributions. Maybe that's why he demeans and humiliates women as if we're objects meant solely for pleasure and entertainment rather than human beings worthy of love and respect. He just doesn't understand us. Maybe that's why he calls communities like the one where I was raised hell. Because he can't see all of the decent, hard-working folks like my parents who took those extra shifts pay their bills on time, folks who are raising amazing families, sending kids to college. Maybe, maybe he doesn't believe that people like us really exist. Because he does not see our shared humanity. And it is becoming increasingly clear that to him, most of America is them. But here's the thing. Look at us. <laughs> Just look at us. We all know better. We all know better. Whether we're Democrats, Republicans, or Independents, it does not matter. We all understand that an attack on any one of us is an attack on all of us. As noteworthy as uh, what the First Lady Michelle Obama said there, Wolf, is where she was saying it. She is in Arizona. That is a state that has been reliably red for many cycles. The last time it went for a Democrat was 1996 when Bill Clinton won the state. The polls are tight there. Hillary Clinton and her campaign are seeing opportunity, and so they dispatched Michelle Obama there today. Chelsea Clinton was there yesterday. Bernie Sanders was there on Tuesday, as they hope certainly with their appeal to Hispanic voters that they're seeing in their favor that perhaps 